you are. <laughs> I, you. We got trouble. The boss went and she refused to let anyone go with her. I feel like she's doing something dangerous. Fursman is in the mines. It seems like the boss. She even took her digger tron. It... Oh, there's lots of bad guys in the mines. Miss Natasha said kids. He's Hook's daddy. And he's like a daddy to everyone in the moles. Thank you. Oh. Calm down, calm down. Save it. We treated you as our lead. Such a rash. You sold the intel about the vein to Antonia, but we discovered it first. Traitor! <laughs> well, nothing to say for you. Go away, you brute! <laughs> oh, little hook? Oh, no, no. Daddy? Yes, I told Antonia about the vein, but I was the first one. <sighs> it's only because you have that detector. Let Back off! I was thinking about the bigger picture when I... Well, I think someone needs to teach you... You'll never lay a finger on... Oh, it's you! <laughs> Another punching bag? Fine, but... Let's go! Huh. Time to twirl! Lend me your strength! Huh. <sighs> Rules are made to be broken. Uh, Don't worry about me. I... Good. That's good. Ah, uh, I remember. You are the outsiders, Natasha Men. The conflicts between the vagrants and the mining team have lasted for quite a long time. Daddy, let's go to the old witch's clinic. But the vein detector, that rapscallion. It's just a tool. Mining team is hired. It's getting late. Where to now? <sighs> I've taken care of your wounds. I'm running short on medical. Don't pretend you didn't hear that, Hook. I'm talking. Hook wasn't the one that caused trouble. It was those bad guys. We see. You are gonna spoil that. <sighs> That's enough for now. I'll say this one last time, Hook. The boss of the moles should stick to her word. <laughs> Thank you again. I if it weren't for you and Dr. Natasha, Hook and I probably would have been in big trouble. <sighs> well, a few days ago, I found a Geomaro vein using... Then, those vagrants heard about it and accused me of being a traitor. They believe that since I'm also a vet, the mining team could not agree with that, of course. Daddy? Are we... My poor child. Daddy is old now. People say I'm selfish, think I'm a traitor, but it doesn't matter to me. Daddy... Forget about it. Since I've got the money, it's just a shame that I lost my vein detector. I guess so. It's an ancient relic that can detect Geomarrow veins. It's very... I often carried it around looking for a new claim. Uh, anyway, I guess I don't need the detector anymore. The less... Hook seems to be giving me a look that says Hook wants to talk to you outside the clinic now. So that's why people call eyes the windows to the soul. you to help yes we can't just stand by that detector is daddy's treasure so all right then I'll be... i mean see ya too slow honorary member of the moles let me introduce you to sweta 
She is daddy. Uh, not at all. Mr. Fursman trusts every But after what happened over at that Geo Marrow. I'm here to find daddy's treasure. He's. Well, I. After the conflict in the mine, Wildfire gathered everyone out of the shelter and took a head count to check. When we returned to the shelter, Mr. Fursman's detector was gone. We searched all. Yes. The shelter was usually crowded, so thieves would have had. A we vagrants have our dignity, too. But. Actually, we've already asked those four suspects about it. Of course, we could never expect thieves to confess and turn themselves in, right? In my... <sighs> All four suspects are at the shelter. If you're feeling confident, why not give it... Uh, adults are so dishonest. Well, well, well. What's this? Spill it! Did you <laughs> you little brat. How dare you label me a thief? Someone needs to give you... <laughs> Anyone can say that. If you really... Oh, you have a temper, huh? I'm a cook. What else would I be doing? Don't you notice the smoke? It's just that I happened to be out shopping for ingredients at that time. That old Fursman was kind to me. When we were at Rivet Town, he put me in charge of the whole mining teams. And it's because I trusted him that I came to this mine with him. I mean, I didn't expect. Anyway, he found that Geomero vein by himself, so I won't blame him for not sharing. But you know, well, I don't want to be a snitch, but the helper over there, I saw him sneak into Fursman's tent and come. <laughs> I don't care if you believe me or not. I've told you all I know. Now leave me alone. Did you steal daddy's- Nope. I'm no thief. Really? Then you better answer- Ask away. Let's not waste time. Mm, didn't notice anything. Good man. But a bit of a cheat. Nope. What did- Hey, would you like- What? I always talk. I don't feel- well, it's the hunch of pitch dark hook the boot. Hmm? Hook? Did you steal daddy? What? Oh, if I'd known I would become a suspect, I. We just need you to answer a few questions. Okay. Ask away. Nothing special. Oh dear, oh dear. I know that's a lame alibi. Mr. Firstman? Oh no, oh no. I must sound very suspicious, but I really didn't do Detector? No. Is that all the questions you have? Have I... <sighs> Did you steal dad? What? How could you say that? You know what a businessman values the most? Reputation. If your slander ruins my reputation and harms my business... Uh... Well, then answer. I have the right to remain silent. I withhold. No. Ugh. I'll give you one more chance. I've seen all sorts of things in my life. Why would I be afraid of you? <sighs> Here, how about we make a deal? Well, looks like I can only continue exercising my smart decision. I I went into town to restock. Nothing out of the ordinary, right? I restock on a regular basis. Fursman is an old customer of mine. He's pretty nice to me, though we are not so close. We're all neighbors. We've known each other for a long time. But he sold out to the other side. Look, the cook is definitely the thief. I'm sure about that. In my line of work, I've learned to read people. And something's definitely fishy with that cook. I Don't worry, I've written it all down for you. Remember, the cook said the helper did it. The tailor said it wasn't her. The merchant said it was the cook. Hmm. Come on, let's go. Figured it out. You've got to be kidding me. Uh, I gave you the answer, and you still couldn't crack the cake. I already told you it was the cook. 
Huh? Is it that hard for you to admit? Uh, just you wait. I'll fi Fine, go ahead. Let's go look around where Daddy kept the detector. Maybe we can find some clues there. This is the label from a supply box. That way! Let's go to... Must have been on this box. <laughs> it's got a spicy smell. Well, not too many people. Oh, the thief appears to have taken Daddy's treasure. Has Daddy's treasure been sold? Or oh, where could the thief have gone? Oh yeah, I saw Mr. Sampo on the way to the. Mo Follow Hook, Mr. Mr. Sampo's always at the clinic, hanging around Miss Natasha. Hook thought he was really sick or something. If he's working with the thief, then he's also a ba- My friend, are you serious? This device is quite rare. No, no, why are you making this so complicated? You two stop right there! Pitch Dark Hook the Great has arrived! Oh, boy. I knew it was too good to be true. I, I gotta make this clear. I have nothing to do with this fella. Hey! How can you sell me out like that? You... You stole Daddy's treasure! This... This is all that old Bursman's fault! Um, well, it seems you guys have some issues to sort out, so... Maybe I should leave. <laughs> what kind of a reason are you looking for? W with the underworld and such... <clears throat> anyway... I... Diggertron, get ready. Yeah. Time to twirl! Lend me your strength. Yeah! Sure, talk tough for someone who can't fight. Hmm. Oh, Daddy's treasure! It's. But... Hey! Of course, I would. Listen here. There's a fellow in Boulder Town they call Balloway the Miner's Lamp. He's an appraiser. Although he claims that he doesn't do appraisal. I think this device of yours is probably worth a lot. Here's a trick. First, pretend that you want to sell it for a low price, then wait for him to excitedly fix the device for you. After this business tactic is what I call... Halloween the Miner's Lamp. Let's go into town to find... Have a safe trip! It's getting late. Where to now? I'm already retired from appraising ancient... Oh, look at this! The detector... Hmm. Oh, ho, ho. This certainly... Oh, yes! Look extra close. This device... I've been in the... I think this is probably beyond repair. But still... The detector's probe is gone. It's like searching for something without eyes or... I'm willing to offer a generous...
have you been, Hook? I was just about to go looking for you. <sighs> What's wrong with this kid? Vain detect- Big sister and Hook helped Daddy get- Daddy's detector. So it was stolen. I'm fine. Um, Daddy- mm. The Geo Marrow. <sighs> I'm sorry. What are you apologizing for? But- Daddy's- <laughs> Don't cry, Hook. <laughs> The detector helped me find lots of Geo Marrow veins, and. But at the end of the day, the detector is. Hook? <laughs> so. Cute. So. The... Is still happily. You are. Are you hurt? Let me take a look. You came at a good time. <laughs> According to my patient records, there are a few that haven't come for their follow-up visits. It happens from time to time. Have you heard of the complex illness? Generally speaking, mutual aid societies like these allow patients to share their experiences and support each other. I've got a few patients who have started refusing treatment since joining the society. And the most suspicious part is that no matter how much I ask, no one's ever willing to tell me. <laughs> it sounds dangerous, but what I want you to do is actually very simple. If I find out they're preventing me from doing my job, or if they're bringing... Can I entrust you with this task? This little clinic has huge numbers of patients to deal with every day. Good luck. I'll be sure to... You. I've seen you in the clinic. Your cover? Let me guess. What's the use? Of course not. Every book I read has descriptions that match my symptoms exactly. I can put people in my situation. A follow up visit is just a. What else is there to say? Natasha was seeing me free of charge. She said it. You think I need you to tell me? Dr. Vash never charged me anything either. Natasha's great. But Natasha's brother? They both used to practice medicine. I heard he was a top student from the Overworld Medical Academy. Bellabog's main hospital wanted him. What do you mean? Dr. Vash was a people's doctor. The underworld is always short of medical resources. You think I don't want to? <sighs> I should keep... I heard that Natasha had something to do with Dr. Vash's death. They say she was jealous. It's just something people were saying. Forget I said anything. Since Dr. Natasha, I'll go to the clinic for my follow-up a little later. Avoiding a follow-up visit due to money issues. I should find another paper. What was that? Oh, you'll have to be. Ah! If follow. Natasha's, uh, uh, oh, but at this age, it's rather a lot to bear. Not for youngsters like yourself. My husband had the same illness as me, but he never, then, one day, he said he was forever saying he wanted to go, but I miss him. Do you think so? <laughs> <laughs> okay, you win. Hmm? Did you? Virtual who? All right, I heard. Avoiding a follow-up visit due to her husband. I should find another. Why haven't I gone for my follow-up visit? Are you a patient? Who else would care about? I don't need Dr. Natasha's help now. Tell her to say. 
<laughs> a dispute? No. I just don't really approve of a method. She tries to save everyone, which means she can't save. Miners like me don't have time for lengthy treatments. If I can't take something and get right back to work, I may have... Did you, uh, know Dr. Vash? Here's what... Dr. Vash's medicine is... different. Lots of... Even knowing the risk, most people fight to... When life forces you to the edge, you'll throw yourself at any opportunity with people like us. A slow and torturous treatment is the same. <clears throat> Forget it. <laughs> what? Listen up. The Complex Illness Mutual Aid Societies. You must not tell any of this to Dr. Natasha. Here, take this. It's the address. A final warning. Do not reveal. I know where to find the wonder medicine. That patient didn't want me to tell Natasha. Hey, where do you think? Medicine. Oh, you're the same as everyone else that comes through here. And we only take cash. Well, the Mutual Aid Society sets the price. It might be different from Dr. Vashin. Well, are you buying or not? Wait a minute. You're close. Get lost. Now. If you're a friend of that... Wait. Get lost. All of you. Save your... Fr that medicine seller is sure shut up shopping. I should... I can report to Natasha. It's getting late. Where to now? Well, are you hurt? Let me take a look. <sighs> so the Mutual Aid Society found my... found Bash's research results. And any organization doing something like this is interested in... I'm not surprised. They'll know that I'm completely against... What Vash left behind is nothing more than re <sighs> I warned the patients countless times, but... Seems like I'm guessing the patients you met weren't exactly singing my praise. I don't blame you. After everything, you if you're curious about Vash's wonder medicine, you should ask... The medicine Vash left behind? <sighs> that I know Dr. Natasha's here, but I have to tell it like it is. Vash had zero... He may have had the capability, but he didn't use it to help anyone. Whenever I went to see him, he never even asked about my illness. If it were you, would you have taken that medicine? Some people say that Dr. Vash was a saint who came from the overworld to help. People's doctor. That's just what people who've bought into the myth like to say. The hard truth is that we were just his test subjects. It didn't... Uh, of course, I can't control... Well, are you hurt? Let me take a look. I still haven't worked out how to... I'm guessing you've heard a lot of different opinions on Vash. I want you to go and visit another patient, a victim of the Wonder Medicine. Once you've understood her situation, come back and tell me... Keep at it! Keep at it! Who are you? Who? Where's my husband? Where? Where are they? You don't know. Where? Come over here, child. That poor, poorly. Oh, not terribly. In order to try and rid themselves of the ailment once and for all, the two began to suffer terribly. So from that moment on, Oh, she became as you see her. And yet, what more could have been done? They were warned about the medicine. Oh, talking about it tires me out. At least... I wish you all a journey that is free... 
Did you speak to her? By the look on your face, I'm assuming... <sighs> Be it Vash or the Mutual Aid Society, forces... Let me tell her. There was once a brilliant overworld doctor. The doctor was set on developing a medicine that would steal... But his research met with obstruction time and time again. The biggest factor being a lack of test subjects. As such, the doctor got in touch with his sister in the underworld. Naturally, his sister was overjoyed. Uh, after all, she brought her brother underground. I think you know what comes next. Issuing free medicine to the needy was just Vash's way of... On some level, his reagents were able to alleviate the patient's suffering, but nothing more. <laughs> the result? Patients with mild illness would attribute their recovery to the so-called wonder. I cannot accept that their fate was simply the result of misfortune or... That's why I want you to help me recover all the wonder medicine. Thank you. This will be hard for the people that have come to rely on the wonder medicine. You mustn't hesitate. Recover every last reagent that Vash left behind. Go. I'll be waiting. Stop right there! Ho-ho! Oh, play it. Wait a minute, you're that clinic woman's lackey, aren't you? Did you think the mutual... She's after our medicine and... Men! Look lively! Huh. Netmarker's activated. Time for a good old counterattack! Time to kill! Uh. Reach the end of the story in your own way. Well, look who we have here. Your reputation proceeds. You listen here. I'm the president of the complex illness. Those poor patients. Along comes a life-saving wonder medicine. The underworld is full of sickness. My mutual aid society has relieved that doctor of pain. Hmm. Seems like you are crying, seeing as you came. Men, seize! Yeah. Time to twirl! Rules are made to be broken. Lend me your strength. Huh. Time to twirl! Mm, blast it! What did we ever do to you? Moneymaker? So you admit it then. You're not in this to save life. What are you doing here? Selling fake medicine with false kindness. I have a responsibility to protect the well-being of my patients. You, well, you can't save everyone. You're right. I can't save everyone alone. But if I must, the debt that Vash owes to the underworld rests with me. Ugh. Ugh. Oh, so stubborn. And I'll take that as a con. Thank you. Your actions today have... I'll find a way to dispose of Vash's leftover reagents. Next time, let's go back to town. I see. It's getting late. Where to now? It looks like the patients have surrounded Natasha. Let's hear what the- What are you saying, Doctor? Correct. That medicine is a wolf and your ailments need rational, scientific treatment. <laughs> rational and scientific, huh? Oh, how, how dare you speak to- Ma'am, please, think for a moment. How can you still be so- I understand your anger, but as your doctor, I ask you to trust my- I will find a way to access more medical resources and help you through your struggles. If I must, I'll get help from the surface. The surface. <laughs> Have some respect for- If it's respect she wants, she better find a replace- I'm out of here. <sighs> well, are you hurt? Let me take a look. Oh, you're here. Mm, I'm okay. 
If I were in his shoes, I may well have had the same reaction. Let's leave it for now. I'll feel a lot- Now's as good a time- If there's anything you wanna- No, but I used- I, uh, actually grew up in the orphanage. My adoptive mother always saw me as her own flesh and blood. <laughs> My adoptive parents belonged to a prominent medical family. As kids, we were ex He was gentle and introverted. Whenever I made a mistake in an experiment, he'd bite my head off. And then a while later... I didn't know he had leftover reagents in Rivet Town. If you fail to make a clean break with the past... <sighs> That's, a. Uh, he saw the human body's vulnerability to cold as a disease, and wanted to cure it so that humanity could survive the eternal free. I do admire his vision and perseverance. I knew his research in the overworld wasn't going well. I used to write to him, and but I was too young to know what long-term frustration could do to a person. During his stay in the underworld, he met patients affected by fragmentum. He began to simulate mild fragmentum corrosion, thinking that it... Those reagents of his aren't cure-alls for critical illness. That doesn't exist. But behind my back, he had been doling out the reagents to residents who were kept in the dark. When it finally... Indeed. And it all happened under my nose. When his experiments were exposed, I spent a long... This was shortly before the underworld was sealed off. There were hardly any Silvermane guards remaining. In the end, Oleg suggested that we banish. Had his victims found out the truth, Vash would have been torn to pieces by furious underworlders. I hope so. The day I learned the truth was the day Oleg and I took Vash to the overworld. He made his final... His figure gradually disappeared into the snow. Forgive me. Let's call it a day. Thank you for cleaning up the mess my brother left behind.